What's going on everybody? Welcome again back to the channel and welcome back for another NASCAR diecast review. Sorry it's been a couple weeks that I have been really busy doing some other projects. Finally got a couple new cars in. I'm going to be showing you those. We'll be showing you this one first. Um, this is a number 42 Kyle Petty. Petty 75 years of racing. This is an STP car. I just got this one Friday. So this one was a pre-order. I think it was like maybe back in February that I got this one or pre-ordered it. So finally got this one. So there you go. It's a Kyle Petty number 42 STP 1981 Buick. One of 600. Standard finish. Petty 75 years of racing. Cool Petty. 75 years of racing box. You got Lee Petty, Richard Petty, Maurice Petty, and Kyle Petty. And over here you got Adam Petty, Mark Petty, and Richie Petty. So it's a pretty cool box. <clears throat> I do love the colors, the red and the blue. All the STP colors. So we're going to open it up. Show you everything that came with this car. As if I've already opened it up once, just so I could check it out. And you got all these return exchange policies if you ever ran problems. And then you get the nice build your own virtual garage card, which if I had a virtual garage, I'd have probably about a uh, thousand cars already in it. If they were all, you know, able to be put in the garage. And then you get this nice petty 75 years of racing sticker. Which is kind of cool. Too bad they didn't give you a couple of them. That way I could actually take one and you know, stick it somewhere. Probably on my laptop or somewhere with my other racing stickers. <clears throat> and then take the cover off. Like I said, I've already took the front scooter from the bottom. So we got the nice Buick front end. It's all plastic. Which I was hoping for would be like die cast or metal or something like other cars from this era used to be. Um, the whole body is, is die cast. It's all metal. Windows, of course, are plastic. The netting is plastic. Which could have been a little bit better. Um, you got your wheels. They're rubber. Of course, the inside's plastic. You got your contingency stickers on there. But for, I think this one was pre-ordered for like $65, which wasn't too bad. But I wish they would have had the uh, deck lid, was able, wish that was able to come up, but it's not. It's sealed shut, or it's just say molded shut. And you got all the nice and <clears throat> STP colors. It doesn't, have, it doesn't even have Kyle Petty's name on there, which I'm not really sure if the real one did or not, or back in 81, which... They should have had his name somewhere. I mean, I don't know when they actually started. When they started putting names on the doors or above the windows. Which I'm sure it probably did, but either that line I'll just didn't put it on there. I don't know. So we got the uh, show the engine in there. Now the engine's not too detailed. Um, I know it looks like it is. It's all molded in one piece. Which, you know, I think that's kind of sad. I think they should have kind of done a little bit better, little bit, little bit better at doing this car. Um, should have been more detailed for the price. But there's nothing underneath the hood. And then you got the rest of the engine underneath. Like I said, it is somewhat detailed, but most of it's from the transmission back is all molded in one piece. You know, they could have had it all in separate pieces. And I don't know what den this is. Um, I'll have to look and see if there's anything in the window. Which I don't think there is. If there is a number in there, I can barely see it. I think there's one down there. But I can't see it. And I'm going to bring it up a little bit more. And see if you guys can see it or not. I can see something, but I can't tell what it is. 
It's, just, it's in there. If I figured it out, or what number it is, I'll see if I can maybe put it in the next video and let you guys know which one it is. But clearly, you know, the number is there. It's just the glare off the glass in the window. So I really can't tell. It looks like it says either 322. There you go, 322. So this is not a high number or low number or anything like that, but go back to bringing it out. So yeah, 322 ain't too bad, but I never try to get number one or hope to get number one or anything like that. So, but yeah, guys, there you go. There you have it. It's a really nice car. Um, I wish it could have been more detailed. The outside is perfect, but like, you know, Underneath, I think could have been it could have been all die cast actually, and then the uh, netting could have been like rubber or you know some kind of fabric stuff like that. Um, would have been pretty cool. But all in all, I think Lionel did a pretty good job. Not a you know one out of a ten, probably like maybe a seven, seven and a half. Could have been a ten if they would have just made this one all metal underneath too, and done a little bit better with the detail underneath. And I'm sure that if they would have done all that, they probably would have jacked the price up another 100 bucks or 50 bucks or something like that. But, but anyhow, thanks again for watching, guys. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell. Leave me a comment down below, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Be safe out there. Bye.